elbow down there. A day off from school filled with sunshine and fresh blooms in Falls Park. I like it when the flowers come out. There's no question Greenville is a beautiful city, but the Asthma and Allergy Foundation of America ranks us as number 32 in the country for worst allergies. We pay a price for living in such a beautiful, lush environment. With lasting warm temperatures and mild winters, nurse practitioner Brandy Guile says every spring she sees an influx of patients in urgent care, mistaking allergy symptoms for the flu. A lot of allergy symptoms, clear runny nose, a mild cough, and just general overall fatigue. The snow in early March offering some relief, but not permanently. A cold snap will freeze that tree pollen, but it's going to come back. Buzzing. I have really runny noses, and my eyes are kind of itchy. AJ Croft and his sister Nora Claire know the struggle. Sometimes I think I'm the reason that my class runs out of tissues. Some doctors recommend a daily dose of local honey. The Crofts stock up on essential oils. I swallow a pill every morning. It's lemon, lavender, and peppermint. Guile says windy days and mornings are the worst for pollen. So if you're going to have any activities outdoors, plan them for the afternoon or after a rain. Brenna McDavid, WYFF News 4 in Greenville.